Bears Highwell Castle. Oh, there's the owl again. The owl's on top of a tree. What do you have to say this time? I think this will also info is actually a little bit more important. Hey, BD, this way. The princess is inside the castle. We know, just ahead. Be careful not to get caught by the guards. Hoo 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 hoot. Yeah, we. On this ground, time flows normally. So just like in Highwell Field. But time stands still while you are in Long Long Ranch or in a town. If you want time to pass normally, you'll need to leave town. Also, time stops in a dungeon. You didn't say that. Well, well, which way are you going to go now? Hoo hoot hoot. Do you want to hear what I said again? You're trying to coax me to say yes. No. Who? You're a smart kid. Good luck then. Hoo hoo. Please. Or at least. The owl talks less in the later section of the game. Your patience will be rewarded. Now, you can also bump into trees, but does it need to be night time? No, it doesn't. You can get a sculpture and hit a rock. Yeah, sculptures can also hurt us. Now, even though uh, the owl uh, said to obviously not get caught by the guards, I am going to get caught by the guards for a pretty... Well, I shouldn't say obvious reason, because remember that little girl, um, Malon, said that her father hasn't come back yet? We're going to help her, but we have to get her to appear. Now, the only way we can seemingly get her to appear, as far as I'm aware, is by getting caught. Okay, we can't have that happen. But see, we got caught, and we just go back a little bit. <coughs> Fright. There she is. What does she have to say? Are you going to the castle, fairy boy? Would you mind finding my dad? He must have fallen asleep somewhere around the castle. What a thing to... What a thing for an adult to do. <laughs> oh yeah, if you look for him, I'll give this to you. I've been incubating this egg very carefully. <laughs> oh, thank you. You got a weird egg. Feels like there's something moving inside. Set it to a C button and see what happens. On the select item subscreen. Yeah, 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 yeah. I might as well actually do that now because we want to pay attention to this egg. All right. Wait, did I even press the right button on my classic controller for Wii Classic Controller for the down C? Wait, why? Uh, hang on a second. Uh, is it this one? Yeah, but still, I think it's better to use down C for that one. Now, we can't get caught by the guards. So we, oh, whoa, no, 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 I want to do this. Do this. Somehow the guard can't see me going down a ladder. Okay. Let's see if we can't get caught by the guards here. Go a bit further along. There's a rock over there, but we'll deal with it later. Now, uh, we go up this slope. Uh, past this guard on the left. Uh, this sort of pathway, yep. Now, don't go uh, to... Yeah, along the path, because otherwise we'll get to the castle entrance, we'll get caught. We have to find another way in, such as that rocky thing we can climb up. Also, now he's not telling us that it's climbable. Still, this game is mostly well designed and allows you to play by ear a bit. It doesn't say you're dumb for not knowing that. Well, maybe a little bit. Okay, let's go swimming. Otherwise, we have the guards will see us easily on the... Yeah. Also, you can press B, uh, repeat, button mash B to swim faster. Just a little bit faster. Nice. Now, if I'm right, um, either at night time, or at least you can come back here with a certain ocarina song, um, and uh, make something happen here. Yeah, we have to come back here with a song. But anyway, it's night time. Hey, I hear snoring. Even it was daytime and you're still snoring. It's Malin's father. Mm. Welcome, our ranch is so fun. Our ranch is so fun. Come on and look around. 
Um, sir, you're not at the ranch, you're at Highwood Castle. Maybe I'll actually use these crates to wake you up. Actually, no, you can't. But I'm going to move uh, the crates while we wait for a certain thing to happen. Okay. Um, all right, I'll push uh, that. Or maybe I should just... No, I'll just push the other one closer to that one anyways. Um, yeah, push that there as well. And then I'll push it all the way here. Okay. We'll be doing this a fair bit. Also, what's that other compass? I think... Yeah, we'll give the compass just to try to tell us we can perhaps go through there. But, yeah, we can use the crates for that, but this guy's blocking our way. We'll just have to uh, wait a bit. I'll be right back. Look, a chicken hatched from the egg you incubating. It's the miracle of life. Which means, wake up, sleepyhead. What in tarnation? Can't a person get a little shot eye around here? Excuse me. Hey, let me talk to you. Maya? <laughs> Not exactly. Hello, and who might you be? Yep, I'm Talon, the owner of Long Long Ranch. I went to the castle to deliver some milk. But I sat down here to rest, and I guess I fell asleep. What? Malin was looking for me? I'm gonna catch her from her now. I messed up bad, leaving Malin behind to wait for me. She's really gonna let me have it. Run, Mario. Where's Luigi? Anyway, uh, <laughs> he does look a bit like Mario, doesn't he? Anyway, we'll push these crates now that he's out of the way. Uh, and we can go through that little opening there now. See, that's just how the game progresses most of the time. Okay then. Uh, yep, there we go. Push. Again, make sure you push in, move into the crates to get climb on the action icon. And of course, you can use the action icon to climb through here as well. Hey, on, this is not Metal Gear Solid, or is it Metal Zelda Solid? Metal Gear Zelda? Yeah, we've got more guards to evade. This can be a tiny bit tricky, but I think for the most part, we should be able to do this in one go. I also like the music here too. Do do, do do. I'll hide from the guards and go to the next a screen that is a weird, slightly weird camera angle. There might be a little complication with the guards there. Maybe I can just go past there and there. There are more than one type of guard there. Maybe I should climb up here. Is that a rupees up there? Maybe I can climb up on this wooden structure and hopefully not get caught by the guards and I went past you like a boss So a snake eat your heart out Though I might play some Metal Gear Solid later after doing this recording session Okay, I'll stop timing my commentary to a beat But anyway, you can see this is fairly easy I think the last screen has somewhat trickier guards, but we'll know when we get there. How can you not hear that? <laughs> How? Go, go, let me go past you. Doo doo, doo doo. Okay, um, Murphy's. Oh, okay, past, yep, 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 past yep. Camera angle, bit closer to that guy at the top, please. Please. Please, and just go past him. Easy, see? Pretty easy. I'm still making noise with my rolling. How can you not hear that? Also, one thing I like about Ocarina of Time is that it has its own secrets. Some of them are helpful, some are not. Like this. Hey you, 
Don't cause any trouble. Air bombs! Oh my gosh, Link, a bomb! A bomb. Oh my gosh, Link, that's... Uh, Bowser and Mario. Super Mario 64 represent. But instead of Princess Peach, we're talking to Princess Zelda, who also has her own music, just like in Link to the Past. Hello. I love you. <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> who? Who are you? How did you get past the guards? Oh, what's that? Is that a fairy? Then, are you are you from the forest? Then, then you wouldn't happen to have the spiritual stone of a forest, would you? That green and shining stone? Do you have it? I do. Just as I thought. I had a dream. In the dream, dark storm clouds were billowing over the land of Hyrule. But suddenly, a ray of light shot out of the forest, parts of the clouds, and lit up the ground. The light turned into a figure, holding a green and shining stone, followed by a fairy. I know this is a prophecy that someone would come from the forest. Yes, I thought you might be the one. Oh, I'm sorry. I got carried away with my story and didn't even properly introduce myself. I am Zelda, Princess of Hyrule. What is your name? Fiddy. Fiddy. Yes, Link can't talk. <laughs> Strange. It sounds somehow familiar. Okay then, Vidi. I'm going to tell you the secret of the sacred realm that has been passed down by the royal family of Hyrule. Please keep this a secret from everyone. Okay. The legend goes like this. The three goddesses hid the Triforce containing the power of the gods somewhere in Hyrule. The power to grant the wish of the one who holds the Triforce in his hands. If someone with a righteous heart makes a wish, it will lead Hyrule to a golden age of prosperity. Ah oh yes, I forget, this is linked to the past in 3D. If someone with an evil mind has his wish granted, the world will be consumed by evil. That is what has been told. Wait, did I even read that properly? I was thinking of Link to the Past. So the ancient sages built the Temple of Time to protect the Tribe Force from evil ones. That's right, the Temple of Time is the entrance through which you can enter the sacred realm from our world. But the entrance is sealed with a stone wall called the Door of Time. And in order to open the door, it is said that you need to collect three spiritual stones. And another thing you need is the treasure that the royal family keeps along with his, le keeps along with his legend. The Ocarina of Time. Well, credits. Did you understand well the story I just told you? Well, I don't want you to tell it again. That's great. I forgot to tell you. I was spying through this window just now. The other element from my dream, the dark clouds, I believe they symbolize that man in there. Will you look through the window at him? Yes. Can you see the man with the evil eyes? That is Ganondorf, the leader of the Gerudos. They hail from the desert far to the west. Though he swears allegiance to my father, I am sure he is not sincere. The dark clouds that covered Hyrule in my dream, 
they must symbolize that man. What happened? Did he see you? Jiang Wei. He doesn't have any idea what we're planning yet. Yes, I told my father about my dream. However, he didn't believe it was a prophecy. But I can sense that man's evil intentions. What Ganondorf is after must be nothing more, nothing less than the Triforce of the Sacred Realm. He must have come to Hyrule to obtain it. And he wants to conquer Hyrule. No, the entire world. So wait, Hyrule is a section of the world? I mean, I know you've got Termina and, you know, other places like in Link's Awakening and all that. But sometimes Hyrule almost is treated like it is the world in the Zelda universe. Vidi, now we are the only ones who can protect Hyrule. Please? Okay. Thank you. I, I am afraid. I have a feeling that man is going, is going to destroy Hyrule. He has such terrifying power. But it's fortunate that you have come. We must not let Ganondorf get the Triforce. I will protect the Ocarina of Time with all my power. He shall not have it. You go find the other two spiritual stones. Let's get the Triforce before Ganondorf does, and then defeat him. One more thing. Take this letter. I'm sure it will be helpful to you. You received Zelda's letter! Wow, this letter has Princess Zelda's autograph. Set it to a C button and show it with that C button. So I have an autograph from my girlfriend. <clears throat> so yeah, so you can hold up items kind of like with the, um, the cuckoo. You know, the one with cockadoodle do, and you know, show it off to people or hold it in front of them. Uh, what? Oh, my attendant will guide you out of the castle. Don't be afraid to talk to her. Oh, right, of course. I thought you had a little bit more dialogue to say. But speedrunners who not use glitches and all that stuff will just go straight to talk to the attendant here. Who is also a recurring character in the Zelda universe when you think about it. I am Impa of the Sheikas. I am responsible for protecting Princess Zelda. Everything is exactly as the princess foretold. You are a courageous boy. You are heading out on a big new adventure, aren't you? My role in the princess's dream was to teach a melody to the one from the forest. This is an ancient melody passed down by the royal family. I have played this song for Princess Zelda as a lullaby ever since she was a baby. There is mysterious power in these notes. Now listen carefully. Memorize this song. Left C, up, right C, times two. Now, I think people will say on the virtual console versions of this game, so they struggle with using the right thumbstick for this. Maybe not me. This is Zelda's Lullaby. That has, it's a tube that's been around since Link to the Past, as has the general structure of getting free fiends at first. It's quite a really cool idea for a game where you can actually play music. You've learned Zelda's lullaby. <laughs> the way Link looks at that ocarina. If a castle soldiers find you, there will be trouble. Let me lead you out of a castle. Okay then. Da 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 you brave lad, we must protect this beautiful land of Hyrule. Take a good look at that mountain. That is Death Mountain, home of the Gorons. They hold the spiritual stone of fire. At the, font, at the foot of Death Mountain, you will find my village, Kakariko. That is where I was born and raised. You should talk to some of the villagers there before you go up Death Mountain. The song I just taught you has some mysterious power. Only royal family members are allowed to learn the song. Remember, it will help to prove your connection with the royal family. 
the princess is waiting for you to return to the castle with the stones. All right, we're counting on you. Hey, where'd she go? <laughs> now, I usually record for an hour and a half with most of my gaming sessions. I'm going to accomplish a little more and then save a particular spot and I'll explain why. Because the save system in this game is a little bit uh, funny, now that I think about it. But anyway, let's go to Kakariko Village, as Zelda and Impa suggest. Wait, can we uh, get anything from this tree? Oops. Now, maybe I'm thinking of night time? <laughs> Anyways, let's go up these uh, stairs to Kakariko Village. Which is also in Link to the Past. Ah, uh, Link to the Past. Such a good game. So is this one. Ocarina of Time and Link to the Past are usually considered two of the best Zelda games. Now, oh, should I do this? Um, maybe not now. Because Yes, I'm just going to um, make a certain little thing happen as befitting um, the direction to Death Mountain. Um, Zelda's letter there will come in handy. Let's see why. So if we go up here, Death Mountain is that way. And would you know there is a guard who won't let us through? Well, maybe now he will. Also, Zelda chime. Oh, this is, this is surely Princess Zelda's handwriting. Well, let's see. Hmm, okay. This is Vidi. He is under my orders to save Hyrule. <laughs> what kind of funny game has our princess come up with now? Okay, okay, all right. You can go now. Just be careful, Mr. Hero. <laughs> you don't need to hold out for letter that long, Link. <laughs> By the way, Mr. Hero, if you're going to climb Death Mountain, you should equip a proper shield. It is an active volcano after all. If you go back to Hyrule Castle Town Market, you should check out the bazaar. Or bazaar? Baza? I've been to one, you know, my travels. They sell the shield you need there. Tell them I sent you and they should give you a special discount. It usually costs us 80 rupees. If you think you're good to go already, don't worry about it. Now. I'd like to ask a favour of you. No, I don't expect you to do it just because of the great tip I just gave you. I'm just asking. Have you been to the Happy Mask shop that just opened in the Hyrule Castle Town Market? Everyone is talking about it. Oh, so after we've seen the Emperor, I guess it opens up. My little boy pesses me for a popular mask, but I don't have time to go there. So could you go and get the mask for me next time you are in the market? If you don't feel like it, that's okay, but, well, I have no choice. This is my job. <sighs> so, with that, um, I actually do also have to call into this session. So, just to get a sense of obviously what is going to happen in the next session, I'll be going to get, going to get the mask for this guard. I'm going to be getting the shield. I'm also going to be exploring a bit more of Kakariko Village. I'm also going to be going up to Death Mountain, of course, and prepare to get the next stone. And also, I will be doing something else, which um, I re recently figured out, sort of, but even though I played this game several times, you don't need to really go all the way back to the forest for. But the reality is, in at least in um, this part of the game, if you save a game um, and turn off, turn it off, you start back at Link's house in Kokiri Forest. Um, normally if I was playing this, and maybe with more energy to obviously not commentate and all that, um, there is another way to get to one of the crucial parts of the game without, that is actually at the forest. So there's something we have to do back in the forest, uh, but what is it you, you people who have not necessarily played this game before might be asking? And why aren't you doing it the other way? Or maybe you veterans might not know what the other way is. I will show it. Alongside hopefully getting all the gold and sculptures and heart pieces. And just having fun with this game. I'm enjoying this game so far. And we've had at least one or two maybe little funny moments. I hope you will enjoy 
the remainder of the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time project done by Vidi of Video Games for Fun and I hope you um, enjoy Vidi Plays. I am going to do my best to have at least three videos a week now. Um, I need more motivation just to get this channel back up and running and I like doing the Let's Play sort of stuff. Um, and you can follow me on Twitch. Um, as of this point, I do intend to get back to it as soon as I can. Um, let's, let's plays on video plays are just a way for me to do commentary without having to talk to the chat. Just mix it up a bit. Um, and who knows if I could even stream, you know, say Ocarina of Time, but obviously I'm not going to do that now. I'm doing, playing this game here. Um, so you can check out Ocarina of Time as I go through it, go through with it, and check out my previous projects if you're so inclined, as well as for Celebration. So, um, enough rambling outro from me, VD. Have a good day or night, whatever it is, and I will see you... Maybe later this week, or if not for next week, for mostly more career time, I might do Animal, Animal Crossing. Like I said, I'm just going to upload weekly, and I'll have a proper schedule sorted out soon. Because I'm also going to schedule for the Top 25 Games Showcase on my main channel. Look forward to that too. Okay, that's enough rambling. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye!